Hi, it's Reagan with Amore Designs. I just wanted to share um, a couple of things with you. I um, went to um, Tuesday morning in Michael's and just got a couple of things that I thought I'd share with you really quickly. I think this is from Tuesday morning. I got this really pretty um, fall colored um, ribbon. And I have this in a sand color and it's really pretty. So I, I thought this would be good for a fall mini. And then um, I picked this stamp up from Michaels. And then I had to get their little cards. It says, write your own story. And I also got the Discover. I think these would be really cute to stick in um, a mini album for like a journaling card. Like in a pocket. And then I got some locking keys. They're actually um, metal clasps, so I thought they'd be cute for charms. And I got some leaves and some angel wings. And I also picked up some of these stamps. I got Discover, Fly, Rest a, mo rest a Minute, <clears throat> Take Some Time, and Write Your Own Story. And then um, I don't remember what else I got from Tuesday morning. I think I got some like... Um, head pins and stuff for jewelry making but when I went I found this and it was only I think $4.99 or four or five dollars and it um is it's open in the back and it just sits on your sits on your desk and I'm gonna hang all of my charms and stuff from it probably down here to make it look like a dress but I thought it was really cute and for four dollars I couldn't pass it up and then um just a few flowers I've been making um with tool, this is um, with a circle, and I just cut out a bunch of circles and then frayed them, like uh, snipped all over them, and then turned some of them, fluffed them out, and then this is uh, burlap, and this is linen that I made kind of a rosette with, I guess, if you will. So there's that one, and then this is another one of the linen, and I just put a button in the center, and then I made this tool. This is with the tattered florals, Tim Holtz dye with the big flower, and um. I just cut a bunch of them and then turned some of them so that they'd be going in opposite directions and it looked fuller and I fluffed it out and glued this bead in the middle and then I took when you cut all of that you know you have all that waste so I just like gathered it up and glued it onto this circle and scrunched it up and put a pearl in the middle and I thought oh that's kind of a shabby flower or whatever and I was messing around and I stuck this on top of this and I was like ooh that's pretty so I made a big fluffy purple one. So the outside of the is a, the tattered, large tattered florals flower from the Tim Holtz dye. And then this is all the remnants. And then I just put a dew drop in the middle. So there's some fun things to do with tool. Oh, and then this one is the circle. I don't know if you can see this. It's the tool circle that I frayed. And then I just stuck one of these Dollar Tree silk flowers in the center and put a leaf on the back and then this is just a little metal piece that I cut off of one of the leaves the prima leaves the stem and twisted it around a paintbrush so there's my little fall flower so I thought those turned out cute and then I also wanted to do a big haul for craft outlet craft outlet is going to be the design team sponsor and also I think maybe the prize sponsor I'm not sure um, but they're going to be the sponsors for the month of November at paper craft star and I placed an or I went to their store and love it. It's all craft stuff um, and tea dyed stuff and it's just so cool and so I placed an order and um, you guys, gorgeous stuff. I think you get, I think I got 50 tags and I don't remember how much they were so you'll have to forgive me but they're already tea dyed or distressed for you. I don't know if you can see. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Got a whole bag of those. And they have tags in different sizes. Like I also got these little tiny scalloped ones. Sorry for all the bag handling. But it all comes so neatly packaged. And um, so these are the little tiny already distressed, grunged up for you, ready to go um, tags. And then they also have the metal tags. And so here's the... I don't know if she wants her phone number. It's it's craftoutlet.com. So 
but super quick service. She's really sweet. Her name is ba Babette, and here are the little metal round tags. Already distressed. I'm loving them. And then they also sell these little, um, kind of like little gift bags. They're cotton, I think. And they're only 20 cents a piece. Super cute. You could stamp on these. You could sew on them. So fun. And then they just tie right on the side. And then they all, she also has these journals. She's got different kinds. And they, she has different kinds of crafts, too. And she also sells um, an ivory and a white. But um, it's a little journal. And I don't know. Kind of close. But little journal. Um, and this is all craft. Whatever, whatever I got was craft. And then look at the pages, you guys. So pretty. So fun to make an art journal out of. Or to sew like pieces of, of scrap paper. And put flowers. And make it a little journal. Super cute. And then these are... Um, Number 10 craft envelopes, and I don't know if I'm going to be able to get this open, but you guys know what an envelope looks like. It's a number 10 craft envelope, and then she also sells 8.5 by 11 craft cardstock paper, and I think these, you get like 10 sheets for, I think 10 sheets for a dollar or something. I don't know, but you guys please go check her out such cute stuff. She has baker's twine. There's some tool, there's some other tools that she sells. There's some kind of, um, something compound. I can't remember. Um, different size tags that are already like grunged and tea dyed, uh, journals, different size envelopes, just everything. And it's so fun. And the only thing, it's all craft. So, um, you've got the paper bag craft, the regular craft, um, the ivory, and I can't remember, but it's such a fun store to just go through and see all the fun, like, grunge tags and everything, so I hope you guys will check them out, because I was really pleased, and I think that's all, oh, one more thing, so today I got a package in the mail from my grandma, and it was supposed to be for my girls, and there were things in there for my girls, a couple Halloween treats, and, um, and some dresses, and some shoes, and stuff for them, but I get to the bottom of the box, you guys, and look. She hooked me up with all kinds of lace and trim. And I'm so excited. And there's so much in here. I can't share it all with you. But most of it is, um, oh, is trim just like this. Kind of different pattern, but in different colors. But it's just trim just like that. And then... Um, some really pretty black lace. I love it. It's gorgeous. And she also, there's different kinds of, um, there's a couple different kinds of eyelet trim. And it has that, you know, grandma house smell. So I think vintage, um, vintage lace and trimmings, but whole box full. I'm so excited because I don't have any and I haven't been able to find any at any thrift shops or I searched everywhere, high and low. But now I have a box full of all kinds of different colors. So thank you to my grandma for that because that's just so exciting. And I think that's all I got for you. I will be back um, probably in a couple days or so with some projects. And I hope you guys are all having a great day and have a super weekend. Thanks. Bye.